الحمد للإله سابغ النعم وخالق الإنسان من بعد العدم فالحمد ثم الحمد ثم الحمد لك حمدا كثيرا طيبا يا رب لك أعطيتنا خيرا كثيرا ربنا سترت عن كل الورى عيوبنا ثم الصلاة بعد والتسليم على النبي المصطفى الكريم The vast majority of our scholars have claimed that growing a beard is obligatory. All four madhabs, the Hanafi, Shafi'is, Maliki's, Hanbali's, have claimed uh, it is obligatory, even Ibn Hazm of the Zahiri madhab. In fact, Ibn Hazm said that there is ijma', and many of the scholars of the past said there is unanimous consensus, there is no known difference of opinion. And they said that, but there is some difference of opinion. Which means that when somebody says there's ijma and then you find a difference of opinion, that at least, the least it'll tell you is that, well, 99.999% of the ummah felt that the beard is obligatory. Hence, the evidences were so overpowering and so many that the vast majority of scholars of our traditions held that the beard is something that men should grow. Now, the point is, though, you're not going to find uh, many books of fiqh dedicating long pages to the discussion of the beard for a very simple reason. And that is that... Growing a beard was a simple sign of manliness for all Islamic civilizations and cultures throughout the 14 centuries of the Ummah. Therefore, the issue never arose. People never trimmed or shaved their beard. It was not, when I say trimmed, I mean like all the way down to like one millimeter. It was not done. It was a sign of your manhood that you grow a nice full beard. You will find here and there small discussions of how long the beard should be grown. But even these, you're not going to find pages and pages in our fiqh book because it was not an issue of controversy. Only recently with the advent of westernization in the last 150, 200 years or so, this is when the issue of shaving the beard has become fashionable. Otherwise, even in Western culture, even in Western culture, the beard was a sign of manliness. And if you look at you know paintings and drawings done of most of the classical you know thinkers, and even in the Western culture, uh, they had beards. It was a sign of, of, of who you were as a man. So the phenomenon of shaving beards uh, is a recent phenomenon, and that is why it has generated a lot more controversy, a lot more scholarship, a lot more writings have been done. <laughs> فوق السهول وبالجبال وبالقرى فوق السهول وبالجبال وبالقرى